hey hello everyone welcome back again hope all of you are doing great uh, in this video i gonna show you how to import or how to install cisco ios image in your evng lab right in last video i have show you how to install uh, ubuntu linux based operating system desktop operating system in evng right it might uh, reflect in i button from there you can check out that video also right so first as we know uh, to install any any uh, ios image or any kind of image we have to first export that right from our, our local system so that's what the same thing i will do i will uh, take the leverage of uh, winscp already you might be familiar with this winscp right because multiple time you have seen this here stuff right so left hand side is your local drive as you see see the news under the users and admin then desktop then cisco images i kept all the image over here in my local drive and right hand side is definitely your uh, evng right uh, and this is the locations always keep in mind uh, the location would be opt then unit lab then add-ons right under the add-ons you might get the multiple three folder qme i will and dynamics uh, you have seen that uh, during uh, the import of uh, ubuntu image we have always imported the qme folder so whenever we install any os uh, windows or linux based operating system we will always uh, keep it in uh, qme and as the cisco ios image it's a dynamics category image right so all you have to do uh, here left hand side let me open the dynamics now i'm gonna uh, transfer this image right let me drag and drop let me press on ok it will it will not take much time mm -hmm. yeah so it successfully transferred right as you see so now what option is left we have to give the permissions right for that we have to uh, take a cli access of the evng right so all right so uh, let me uh, log in yeah i have already logged in though so this is the command uh, we have to use to get the permissions right uh, forward slash opt unit lab then wrappers then unl then under uh, score then wrapper again then, uh, then this are the command right i will put this command to in your description box from there you can copy and use it out yeah and even this command type of stuff you will get from the event side itself all right so i have imported successfully right i have given the permission all the stuff i have done so from my side it's done now i have to check event side so where is the event yeah here is the event let me import try to import one image whether it is there or not oh something is there. yeah here it is right uh, cisco ios dynamics here is right hand side you can see always uh, uh, observe this thing right uh, whenever you try to add anything whether image is there or not right so yeah uh, image is there i am not going to add more slot because i don't need any uh, any interface right away so let me save all right so it's 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 uh, imported now what we'll do we'll connect uh, this router to our management network with the first ethernet 00, zero right so now what left let me switch on this guy yeah it is switched on let me press the default configuration in no uh, so all network engineer is very much familiar with this right let me show right so only one interface it is showing because i have not taken i have not selected any um, other interfaces right so first how what i will do i will up this interface first return it zero by zero put the nose down right let me get out from here no no no, no sorry i'm not going to get out from here let me put the ip addresses 16.0 dot let's say 2 right then 255.255.0 one extra is going to be free yeah so ip is uh 222 uh then submit mask then let me put no shut down again it's my bad habit one thing i have to check that is the ip route is needed right because if i don't give the route how it will reach to the default gateway 
all right dot zero dot zero dot zero zero dot zero dot zero dot zero all right so everything seems okay let me ping to the default getter what is my default getter 16 dot zero dot one right it is reachable yeah it is reachable now as i am connected to management network whether i am able to reach internet yeah i am able to right so my router is reachable to internet anytime i can give you the access over the internet you are from anywhere in the world right you can get the access if i permit you yeah so now it is it is okay uh, so everything is fine right so yeah thank you uh, thanks for your time uh, over here and now i will switch on the ubuntu machine all right now it's turned on all right even my ubuntu machines having gateway also yeah let me test one two three i have to check yeah uh, from there let me check what ip i have configured in the router uh, let me memorize Sixteen dot zero dot two two two. Yeah, I am reachable to the router, right? Because even I have the gateway. Mm. Okay, all right. Everything is fine properly. Thanks. Thanks for your time.